Cancer is one actually the series that gets really rough here in the Galapagos uh, National Park. But this is, this is doable. Amazing Exactly. Well, what I said tomorrow, we're going to spend the whole day on Santa Cruz Island. In the morning, we're going to visit the Highlands. In the afternoon, we're going to visit Charles Darwin Research Station. See, as usual, 7, 7.30, and at 8.30, uh, we're going to do our disembarking. It's going to be the visit up to the Highlands, two different places. First of all, a nice romantic volcanic formation with crater sinkholes known as Los Gemelos, Spanish for twins. The second visit up in the highland, it will be a large natural, of course, lava tunnel. Please, but tomorrow morning, visit if you have uh, some flashlight or headlamp or breathing along. Okay, inside the lava tunnel, there's going to be uh, artificial light, right? But never is enough to have bring along extra ones. Sometimes you break down the power, so they shoot down the power in town, and we cannot get any energy out there. So it's better to be prepared in advance. But for all of us, no shoes. No shoes will be uh, mandatory because the highlands of Santa Cruz is very green and real lush at this time of the year. It's drizzling from time to time, and that area, that habitat, it gets wet and muddy. So that's why we need close shoes. Okay? That is going to be you. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> that's going to be our second discovery into a large natural lava tunnel. Okay? And the third visit, it will be dug into the heart of tortoise habitat. So tomorrow morning, it's going to be our very best opportunity to see giant tortoises, population natural from Santa Cruz Island, up in the highlands of that island. No? Pretty big ones. 400 to 500 pounds in weight, fully grown males. Females, much smaller. Rojo. Oh. <laughs> 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 I was gone until I said I was here. Really? Yeah. I wonder if the backwards makes sense. I don't know. I think it's to make more difficult on inside and the way it makes so in the morning, three different places, all of those ones, the Highlands of Santa Cruz, very first one, sinkholes, pit craters, Los Gemelos. Then we start moving downhill to visit the lava tunnel, and we ended up our morning discovery in the habitat of giant tortoises. We need close shoes, we bring along, besides the flashlight headlamps, we bring along an extra pair of socks, because in case the terrain will be wet and muddy all around that area, it gets really, really muddy, you know, as part of the facilities on the press will be looking for the tortoises, they provide to the visitors the rubber boots. So we can change our regular tennis shoes and use those ones. But of course, the the, the number of the pair of uh, rubber boots they provide is limited. So please try to grab the ones that are least get as good as possible for you. Don't expect to have exactly the right sizes because anyways, this is uh, it's not charged. For this, uh, for this facility, for the boots, okay? So, um, and we'll be moving, hopefully tomorrow, it will be very dry, so it won't be necessary to change shoes for the boots, but it will be moving into the, um, the heart of the tortoise habitat. It will take you into their habitat of the tortoises and may prepare yourself to get dirty shoes, hands, it will take you into the forest where they are fun in that area. You know, it's a very nice place, Bring along your cameras, water, some protection, right? And we'll be out of the boat for about three hours. We're coming back around 12.30 or so, and upon arrival, lunch will be served. That's for tomorrow morning. Lava tunnel, scene holes, and tortoise habitat. Wow. Okay. Okay? We can make it. All right. We can do it. Okay, so that's what tomorrow morning. 12.30, everyone will be back on the boat, and then right away lunch will be served. In the afternoon, we're going to have a meeting for your disembarking in order to visit the Charter Research Station. Our meeting, it will be at 3 in the afternoon, and will take approximately 30 minutes, right? As soon as we ended up our, um, which actually is going to be a um, departure orientation talk, no, and we're going to be our last briefing for 
last day Sunday morning, you know, we're going to put our panel to visit the church that we research station. The visit at the Darwin station is going to take approximately an hour, maybe an hour and a half, you know, um, and then we um, we return all together to downtown by foot, so approximately 15 minutes, and then you're going to have a free time in town. So those of you who want to take your email, so there's internet, Wi-Fi internet on most of the restaurants over there, so you just make a little order and they give you the password code so you can bring down your um, your laptop, your cell phone, anything you want to use Wi-Fi in town. Also for those of you that again, would like to mail some postcards, you can get the postcards at any local um, gallery store with the, with the stamps alone. For any destination out of the country, here in Ecuador, it's two dollar stamps. In any destination, so Asia or United States or, or Peru, it's two dollars um, out of the country. <laughs> that one was really good. Okay. But please make sure, if you're interested to buy some postcards, make sure that you get the stamps from the same shop where you get the postcards because they never sell in that part. Okay? In case somebody um, needs to get um, some extra cash for uh, your expenses in town and get on the boat, there is ADMs. There is ADMs back in the town. And uh, what we always recommend is <laughs> what we always recommend is that all your transactions your eyes. Yeah, and I try to see all your eyes so I'm just making this. So what we always recommend is you know for additional expenses, get down or hit on the boat, do it by cash, because with credit card now they they um they um charge the fee of the credit card either ten or ten percent plus the color and tax which is twelve percent. If you're gonna take extra cash from the ADN, you know, the transaction will be less than 3% of the final amount you will be requested. Okay? Always is better cash. Preguntas! Questions! <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a plan! Of course! <laughs> Perfect. So that's for tomorrow. Highlands for tomorrow morning. I was waiting and this for this. Uh, in the afternoon, Darwin Station, plus free time. Okay? No questions? Everything's good? Yep. Are you ready for dinner? Yes. Uh, but what? Yeah. Okay, everyone, one more thing. Remember that during the afternoon we're going to have our important talk. It will be important to all of you here. I'm going to just set here um, the Captain Friend email list. So please, when you have a time, write down your emails and your names alone. And for tomorrow, Meanwhile, orientation talk for next day to part two. You know, I can just print copy for all of us to keep in touch and also to spread all the wonderful photos you have to give me the penguin, and that's what I really love it. <laughs> that we have been taking along during the seven days here in Galapagos, and also it will be a good excuse to keep in touch as a good friend as we've been doing this Galapagos experience. Sounds like a plan! It is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everyone. Thank you very much for your attention. Have another wonderful evening. And then I will be served in a minute. Thank you so much. We're going to write down our agenda. Right. They are ready. Time to eat. Let's go. Let's go.